of the speech, describing J.D. Vance as, quote, unprepared, unqualified, and willing to do anything Donald Trump demands. President Biden himself took a softer tone in a BET interview airing this week, calling Trump's running mate a, quote, great guy and hardworking senator, but a, quote, really conservative MAGA Republican. It is 642 here on your Thursday morning. Let's bring uh, KIMT Storm Team 3 meteorologist Sean McAday in for your every 10-minute weather update. Sean, good morning. What are you tracking for our Thursday? Well, it's going to be a great day to get outside. What more can I say? We've been talking about that all morning long. But coming up, we're going to talk, and I should say in about two minutes, you're going to hear me talk more about the weekend because that's what our eyes are starting to look to now. It's Thursday, right? High pressure today and tomorrow is going to keep everything sunny, everything great, everything nice, smooth sailing. But on the back side of high pressure, winds flow out of the south because winds flow clockwise around high pressure, right? So as this moves east, we're going to start to get some of these southerly winds. That's going to increase the temperature. It's going to increase the humidity. It's going to increase the winds. And with all of that, those are ingredients for storms, thunderstorms. I was talking about four fingers there. Three fingers is what I need. So we'll be tracking some chances on Sunday and Monday. And maybe even on Saturday, though Saturday I think is still looking pretty nice. Temperatures right now in the low to mid 50s. You're stepping out the door with a jacket, most likely. You don't say I don't think you need it, but it's not a bad idea. Now in about two hours' time, we'll be into the 60s. You don't need it anymore, but you know maybe maybe you do want it. I'll leave it up to you. This morning, though, I bet you hot coffees will be more popular than iced coffees wherever you get your coffee, or if you make it yourself, good for you. 10 a.m. this morning, we're into the mid to upper 60s, though, and by that point, it's starting to feel a little bit more like summer again. But yeah, this morning, maybe a jacket, a hoodie or something uh, out the door. Not a bad idea. Something long-sleeved with a little bit of, of a layer. You'll need that through about 8 or 9, and then we're into the 60s and the mid-70s this afternoon. Today is about the best day you could draw up to go for a run in July. Normally in July, you got humidity. It's in the 80s. It's just humid and stormy. Windy? No, none of that today. Today is the best of everything. Today's a great day to hit some of our county fairs going on. Mid-70s this afternoon at the North Iowa Fair in Mason City. It's a great day for that tomorrow as well. A touch warmer. We hold on to those mid to upper 70s into Saturday as well. Saturday, a 20% chance of rain. It's not much, but the reason that's there is because humidity is starting to go up into Saturday. It's only there a little bit, but by Sunday, it's there. And we're dealing with better chances for rain as that high pressure moves east. Like I said, we get those winds that breeze out of the south. That's bringing us more humidity into the weekend by Sunday afternoon. There's a great signal for scattered showers or maybe some thunderstorms in the mix that we'll have to keep an eye on. And that likely lingers to some degree. Here we are into Monday as well. By Tuesday, it might still be here, but things are starting to calm down into the middle of next week. So as we look at the next five days, today and tomorrow are the days where we don't have to deal with rain chances. You do, you absolutely do as we work into the weekend. So your seven day forecast, the takeaway is that this great weather that we had yesterday, we get it again today. We're lucky enough to get it again tomorrow as well. Do we get it this weekend? Saturday's all right. Sunday, I don't, I, it's, it's humid. Same thing early next week. Uh, so get outside today, guys. Great advice. Thanks, Sean.